I'm a victim of Harry Reid's and I'm coming out of the shadows. But I still have to wear a disguise because of the persecution. It's out now. It's all over the internet. So I had to respond. I'm an adult now and so I guess I can handle being victimized by this older man. An anonymous friend of mine called me up on the phone and said, Hey, Reed. I said, Hey, anonymous friend. He said, Your name is being used for very evil purposes. And I said, Oh? Anonymous friend. He said, Yes, Reed. Type in your name. R-E-I-D. And so I did. And what I found at the bottom of the first page was a story from Time Magazine talking about how Harry Reid had challenged Mitt Romney to show his taxes for the past 10 years. But the way he did it, many people are calling outrageous. And so now the name Reed is being associated with outrageous names like pederast, child molester, and liar. And I'm none of those things. So now Harry Reed has victimized Reed Bear. That's me. And it's a burden I'm going to have to bear for the rest of my life. Because I don't know about any of that perverted stuff. I'm happily married straight guy and a grandpa. And, you know, I've paid my taxes for 10 years. And, and I can prove it. The uh, H&R Block will help me prove it. And I don't know what to do from here on out. I, I want some help. I mean, the Urban Dictionary has got all kinds of nasty things to say about the word read like it was some kind of an adjective now. It's been given for Pinocchio's the name. And that's very hurtful to me. And PolitiFact called Harry Reid pants on fires. So aren't people going to think Reed Bear is pants on fire? How do I escape this, this prejudice, this victimization by that liberal wacko job, Harry Reid? I'm not. I'm a conservative. I don't know. Maybe people could start calling me Mr. Bear, you know, or Brother Bear, like the, the movie. Because I'm not terrible. I'm not horrible. But a very hairy reed has ruined my life. And I want to know how to get my good name back.